गुड मॉर्निंग वी आर फ्रॉम एस वी एस एम्बेडेड द प्रोजेक्ट टाइटल नेम इज कॉल्ड जी एस एम बेस्ड स्मार्ट होम ऑटोमेशन यूजिंग एंड्रॉयड मोबाइल ऐप हियर आई एम यूजिंग एन एस एम एस ऐप सो इन दिस प्रोजेक्ट आई एम यूजिंग ट्रांसफार्मर बेस्ड पावर सप्लाई इसे टू थर्टी इनपुट स्टेप डाउन ट्रांसफार्मर 12 volts output, bridge rectifier, filter capacitor, and one 7805 regulator. I am regulating 5 volts power supply purpose. So this is an power supply section. So I am using one uh, Android mobile phone. In this phone, I am using an uh, SMS app. This is transmitter section as well as receiving the X, uh, SMS with success successful confirmation. So in this project. So I am using an AT89S52 microcontroller. I am using that is called 8051, but we can use uh, AVR, PIC, MSP430, or Raspberry Pi, or Arduino Uno R3, Arduino anything. So here we are connecting Max232. It's an level converter, voltage level stabilization IC. So we are connecting GSA modem, SIM 900A. So here uh, we are giving an any airtel sim card this is gsm modem so you can use any gsm it's a 950 850 mega h to 1800 mega h frequency it's working under 9600 bits per second so here i am sending the sms it is receiving and it is given to the microcontroller the microcontroller will take care of everything and it is a uh, uh, bulb one on means relay on bulb on so here the relay is spdt relay Yes, PDT, uh, single pole double through relay. So it is an on-off switch purpose. I am using relay one, relay two, relay three. Three relays or twelve volt SPDT relay. Bulb one, bulb two, bulb three. You can connect any AC appliances called bulb, fan, heater, whatever it may be. So here I am using a DC fan, small DC fan. Here I am using an 16 cross 2 LCD display. Whatever the process is going on the microcontroller, that should be displayed on the LCD. It is connected to the port zero, port one cap zero, one cap one, one cap two, one cap three of the 889 S52 microcontroller. So this is the power supply section. So here I am using an Kill software, embedded C language, and ISP programmer. So these are the components. 89s52 16 cross 2 lcd display max 232 relays and gsm modem bulbs and small dc fan so i am using an kill software express pcb okay so the mainly purpose is home appliances electrical appliances monitoring and controlling so let us coming into the hardware side so here uh, we are using an AT eight nine S five two microcontroller. First of all, we are going for a transformer. Here two thirty input step down transformer, twelve volts with five hundred milliamps current. So here we need to connect this. This is two pin relevant cable. So bridge rectifier four diodes, bridge rectifier filter capacitor seven eight zero five regulator and LED. So this entire section is called power supply section. So here our microcontroller is eight nine S five two microcontroller. we can use any microcontroller that depends upon your requirement port 0 port 1 port 2 port 3 total four ports each port consists of 88 pin total 32 input output bidirectional port 0 connected to the 16 cross 2 lcd display character lcd display port 2 i am not using here uh, 18th and 19th is connected to the crystal crystal is the heart of the circuit for the controller to generate the clock pulses to the internal cpu to run the internal program so here we have a switch that switch is called the reset push button if program is stuck we need to reset this button active low reset active high reset sorry okay so here port 1 cap 0 port 1 cap 0 1 cap 1 1 cap 2 okay and port 1 cap 3 it is connected to this matter means this Uh, one cap zero, one cap one, one cap two is connected to the relay. So here we have a SPDT relay is there, single pole double through relay. So we are giving the input to the relay. 
means transistor transistor is connected to the uh, relay relay will on and off according to the microcontroller it is one the relay will be on according to the ac if we connect here the bulb will be on okay again again so here we have a max 232 ic uh, level converter voltage level stabilization purpose we are using okay so uh, port p3 cap 0 and p3 cap 1 it is connected to the max 232 ic and here we have a gsm modem sim 900 so we, i am using an atl sim card so these are the three bulbs so now i am going for the connecting of uh, so i am giving the input power supply to the gsm modem and i am giving the input power supply to the board and i am giving the power supply to the up bulbs also so here android mobile phone please connect your gsm modem gsm modem is connected connected so now i am going for my app okay after checking it will ask you the this is the mobile number okay so sms app so after registration registration okay so i'm i'm using my airtel sim card 9515348927 register okay the registration is successful waiting for sms okay now reset gsm based home appliances control using gsm android app please connect gsm modem gsm modem is connected after gsm modem is connected it will ask for the it will show you the mobile number which number we are using for sending the sms to the particular mobile number it means it is checking it means in the sim card they have a deleted sms it means a lot of messages are there now in they are deleting 10 sms sending sms to the gsm modem right so it is asking now okay so bulb one on i am pressing here okay so we can observe that uh, bulb one sms sent okay message reading bulb one on according to the bulb one will be on and we received one confirmation that confirmation is called the bulb one is on bulb one on here that bulb one on success okay again i am going for fan on fan on fan on okay fan on message sent fan on success now i am going for the third one second one one bulb on one fan on suppose second bulb on second bulb on so we will read the we will uh, receive the sms second ah l second bulb on where i bulb two on okay and suppose i am going to off the first bulb Okay. Bulb one off. I will receive one SMS called bulb one off. Bulb one off. Now I am going for a third bulb on. Means this bulb third bulb will be on <coughs> third bulb one third bulb one third bulb one here the confirmation third bulb one okay i got the success message back back 
suppose fan off fan off fan off fan off okay Like that, we need to on the bulbs and we need to off the bulbs by using app. So under app, we designed under app particular mobile number to switch on and switch off. Whenever the we are sending the SMS to the mobile phone, and the mobile phone will receive uh, GSM modem. GSM modem will receive the SMS, and the GSM modem will send the particular mobile number. Whichever the mobile number is feeded, that mobile number we need to send means successful information. Bulb one on, bulb one off. Bulb two on, bulb two off. Bulb three on, bulb three off. Fan on, fan off. So this is an uh, microcontroller based smart home automation. Thanking you. If there is any doubt, let me know to SVS Embedded.